Lisa. Inkanyena. She's a beautiful female. Now, go, there come the cubs. Isn't this exciting? Definitely going to have to dig out the camera. Oh, they're looking quite well fed, the little ones. So they are still in the coral, that's why we're not going any closer. Isn't this special? Here come the little ones. If I remember correctly, there's a boy and a girl. I've seen them once before. They should be about four months old now. I'm going to walk right past Shanae. Look at her looking back, saying, come on, hooligans, keep up. Get a nice photo for Shanae. Look at that, isn't that wonderful? We're just going to keep still. She is moving towards us. And look at those little round, rotund bellies. Obviously, in Kanyen has been keeping them well fed. These little guys are really relaxed and they are uh, they're over four months old now. Oh, there's a, there's a lazy one. in the special. So I think this is the first time the cubs have been seen on the live drives. So unfortunately in the area where we are at the moment Morning, morning, I am just um, our FC comms are a bit, bit staticky, so I'm just going to ask them to repeat that again. So, Angel Lady says, In Kanyen has the most beautiful tail. Oh, look at that shaft of light coming out from the clouds behind. Now, wouldn't it be incredible if that shaft of light was popping through right on them like a spotlight on a play? Now, she looks nervous. From what I heard, there were male leopard tracks. So there could be quarantine or, or another male around, and that's why she's moving these cubs. So you could be trying to get away from a male leopard. I did hear about tracks of a male leopard nearby. And male leopards kill more leopard cubs than anything else, more than hyenas, more than lions. Check over. She keeps checking over her shoulder. It might be worth our while if she does cross into Kruger because she is heading that way uh, for us to go back and check towards uh, three in a row pan.
We're just going to go around so we don't block everyone's view. Morning, morning. Isn't this exciting? The first time in Canyon's cubs have been seen. She keeps looking back over her shoulder. We're going to stop now. And apparently Sam has finally found his jackal. So when she's just moving into a slightly wooded area now, we're just jumping up ahead again. and coral at the moment. We're right on the boundary. There she goes. She's going to pop out into the open right here next to us. Look at those little ones. She's definitely nervous about something and I think it could be those male leopard tracks that were called in a little bit earlier and she's trying to get these cubs to safety. The way she keeps staring back over her shoulder. What's that? Is that what I'm going to do? wondering why would she have chosen such an open area to walk through it's so exposed for the little ones well aqua it's the quickest way to get away from whatever the potential threat she's moving away from is little girl next to her at the moment. I think the little boy is lagging. They're walking straight towards us. They're going to come literally past almost on top, like right next to us. This is just the best. Look at that shit right here. We've got a cub. It looks like the cubs are going to cross either side of us. That's in Canyon. Oh, you can hear that little contact call. Ooh. Now we've got decisions. Here's the little boy. And behind Dave is the little girl. But we'll stick with the little boy. Absolutely magic. There they go. We're going to have to reposition. What are you for? Shab, how are you doing? Right. Is she running from a Wanuna? Or? Yeah, running from Wanuna. Yeah, Which one? Do you know which one? Un? Looks like Shivamalan. Shivamalan. Okay. So there we go, guys. There's the answer. And we're going to just move now. Thanks, for. So it seems like Shivambalan is back there and uh, of course if he happened to come across those cubs he would kill them. There we go, there she is. She's moving slightly further away from the boundary now. She's moving deeper into Nkoro. Uh, we will try see if we can see her for as long as possible, but I think we are going to lose her now as she cuts further north into the block with those two gorgeous little cubs. Oh 
man, wasn't that special.